Hello again, it's Mary and I go by Blue Dane Vintage. I'm an online reseller and I sell pretty much anything um, I can get for cheap and flip for a profit. And lately I've been sourcing a lot of clothes. I love to source clothes, but I hate listing clothes because it kills my back. Um, so I've been picking up clothes for super cheap and sending them into ThreadUp or taking them to buy sell trade stores. Um, I source at places like The Bins and I also have a couple of uh, like honey hole thrift stores where they have like a quarter day or 50 cents day um, and so my latest haul that I'm going to show you is from um, a thrift store that has had every you know certain items marked down to 50 cents each and I picked up some stuff and a few things I got that were like just half price or full price I'll show you those first but the ones for 50 cents um, I will I will show you those after that and I can't talk because I'm a dork. Anyways, the first few items I'm going to show you were just half off. They weren't 50 cents, but uh, they were still a good deal. And the first is this pair of Mark Fisher wedge shoes. I've never heard that brand, so I don't know if it was if it's um, good or not. And everything marked uh, the previous month is half off. So these were what does that say? Three. These were three dollars. And then a pair of Dana Buckman cute slip-on sandals. And these were marked at uh, for May for five dollars. So these were two fifty half off. And then a pair of seven for all mankind jeans. And I believe these were three dollars half off of six. And then I've never heard this brand. Where is it? Well, I guess it's just on the back. Blue. Oh, I had it the other day. Blue. Oh, Blue Tattoo. I've never heard of that brand, but I thought these were really cute. So I picked these up, and these were, I believe, two fifty. And then one more pair of jeans, Araya. I haven't heard of that brand either. But I picked them up anyway because they were cheap. And then this really cool vintage belt. And this will probably go with me to the next vintage market that my sister and I do, unless my son or his girlfriend claim it. Same with this sweater. The brand is Concrete, and it's a men's kind of a grandpa cardigan sweater. I think it's 90s, but if my son doesn't claim it, it's kind of itchy, so he probably won't want it. Um, this will go with me to the vintage market, or I'll sell it on eBay, Mercari, or Depop. I should say I'll list those on all those places. Um, so the first item, the, all the rest of the items were 50 cents each. And the first one is Sonoma. Just a little denim dress, shirt dress, super cute. I'll try that on thread up. And here is a new with tag Z Nana. Really pretty black top with long sleeves. Oh, and it's got like a cold shoulder sleeve. Very cool. Thread up. And this is Gaze. Just a little cropped long sleeve uh, color block t-shirt. I might take this into the buy sell trade store first, like Plato's Closet, and there's another one locally, like a, a little mom and pop one. And this next one is Monto. Just a pretty, if I can get it right here, just a pretty little top little sleeves, three-quarter bell sleeves, and a little ruffle, and a bonus hair there. Take it off. Real pretty. And a gap button-up shirt with a really fun print. I might try that at the Buy Sell Trade store first. And this is a Roxy 
their uh, pullover hoodie with kind of a cowl neck almost. And it's got zipper pockets and then the little patch on the back. If you can see that. Might try that at Plato's first. And then this is Ann Taylor Loft, just a white, little white eyelet blouse with three quarter sleeves. You know, I actually might just take everything to the buy sell trade first. That way I get quick cash. Um, yeah, and then take the rest, uh, send the rest to thread up that they don't want. This is Audi, new with tag top, like a tunic top with three quarter little sleeves. The last big bag I brought to the threat, the, the buy sell trade stores, they only took one thing. But the time before that, they took a good amount of things and I made like 30, 32 bucks. This is Nom. I've never heard this brand as most of these. It's like a gauze material. I need to research and look up what these brands are. And then a pair of Lucky Brand 50 cents, people. I mean, these are better than Ben's prices. And that's 10 items. Next we have Nulero, which I don't normally pick up unless it's super cheap, but it's a cute skirt. And Donna Ray, New York. Cute little cropped blazer with really cute detail on the edges. Then Bisu Bisu. Zubi Zubi Zu. I don't know. Uh, another cute cropped blazer with really cute detailing on the back. And then Banana Republic. Just a plaid button up shirt. I don't know if this is a guys or girls, but it looks kind of like a, a smallish, so I think it's a, a girl's. Then we have Ann Taylor Loft with the mark from Goodwill. Thank you very much. Um, but again, these are from my one of my favorite little thrift stores, not Goodwill. Just a, a basic gray blazer. And then L or Ellie. Just a little sheer floral blouse. So pretty and feminine. With three quarter sleeves. Then a Billabong t-shirt. This is a guy's, obviously, so it'll go. I will try this at Buy, Sell, Trade or put it online. And then a, well, Majestic brand, but a Packers, a women's Packers t-shirt. I'll try this at Buy, Sell, Trade for sure. That's 20 so far. I lied. We're not at 20 yet. I had two more pieces that I forgot for that last group of 10. This has no tag, but I just thought it was fun. Just a skirt. I don't think it's vintage, but I think I'm gonna bring it. I think it's funky enough to bring uh, and add to my clothing uh, rack at the vintage market. But I thought it was just really cute. And then this makes 20. It is a pair of pep paper denim and cloth. 3T toddler jeans. They're like joggers style. I thought they were fun. And I can send these to thread up because they take kids clothes. So that's 20 items. Okay, going to the next 10 items again. These were all 50 cents each. We have a gap. Just kind of a gray pullover. It's really soft sweatshirt. And Prana, elastic waist, uh, are these cargo? Kind of, not really, just khaki shorts. These are women's. And then Weekend Warriors, just a print t-shirt 
really cute. Love yourself with butterflies and a little detail on the sleeves. I'll take that to buy, sell, trade. Uh, denim 24-7. Just a really pretty blouse. I love the purple. Floral three-quarter sleeve. And L or Ellie. The black top with the cute detail there. Three-quarter kind of a dolman sleeve. And a pair of LuLaRoe leggings. Again, 50 cents. Otherwise, I wouldn't pick them up. I saw trade. Um, GNW, Great Northwest. Is that what that stands for? I thought this was a fun print. Cute top. And East Fifth. Really pretty skirt. With those little flared flared at the bottom. That is 30 items. Oh, no, I have two more. I keep forgetting. Uh, just a pair of bum equipment, guys. Swim trunks. I'll take those to buy, sell, trade. And a kids brand new with tags, U.S. Polo Association button-up shirt. It's a little boy. And I can, again, I can send that to thread up. That is... Yeah, that's 30 items so far. Next item is Eddie Bauer, just a little cable knit lightweight cardigan and Urban Outfitters, just a big slouchy sweater. I know it's not heavy sweater season. Put your hands in the holes of my sweater. Sorry, I can't help myself. Anyways, I will still send this to thread up because they take a while to to uh, process things. Or if they send it back to me, I'll just by then it'll be fall and I'll take it to uh, the buy sell trade stores. And here is another East Fifth skirt. This one is a uh, more of kind of a fall look, but it's also Got kind of a flared, flared hem. And these last few items are guys, things that I'll take to buy, sell, trade, or sell them myself. Just a Nike long sleeve performance material shirt. And um, Connie Gold. I don't know. But I thought it was a kind of a cool polo. And it's wet because I spilled a little bit of my water bottle in the bottom of my big Ikea bag. So I need to hang that up. And Banana Republic, another polo. And then just um, an Alaska t-shirt. I'm kind of seeing like travel shirts and wilderness, you know, wildlife, nature shirts are going. And that is 37 items for 50 cents each for a total of 1850. And I think I would have spent more at the bins. So I think that's a pretty good deal. We will send some of these to thread up or take them to buy, sell, trade and see how we do. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next one. Bye. Hey, it's Mary. Um, I go by Blue Dane Vint.